tell us about your favorite book that you've been reading. My favorite book? Well, it goes back five years and it's a great book and everybody should have one on their bookshelf. What is it? No, it's not that one, it's the Quran. How I got introduced to the Quran was I was on the plane coming back from New York. Yeah, that's over that way. Oh, no, it's not. It's over that way. <laughs> and the thing is, believe it or not, really, this guy was reading the book. He left it on the seat when he got off the plane like me. And you know what? I chased after this guy and said to him, Hey, you mister, you left your book. And he said, No, you keep it. I said, Well, okay. So I kept it. And then I was waiting in the New Airport lounge in the phone. And what happened? I started to cry when I read the Quran. So I put the book. I read it twice a day. And not to that, I keep it under my pillow. And, and you, also you know, read it to people as well. Don't I you? do, and I'm just going to go with that. But, and not only that, as an activity coordinator working with people with dementia, I read it to them. And the thing is, they ask me questions. I don't know all the answers, but I know there's one thing in the Quran. What is it? Truth. And if you was lost in the desert, or you was lost somewhere in town, you'd ask somebody away. What's the Quran? It's a map for life.